Hey everyone, it's Tim from Lone Elsa Farm Specialty and Heirloom Livestock. Thanks for joining us again today. Today we are going to talk about basic breeding soundness, what that means and what you need to do to ensure that you get the right buck or ram for your farm. Stay tuned to find out more. So we recently got a call from a friend of ours and they said, we're going to pick out a new ram lamb and we want to know what it is that we need to know about that ram. And we got to talking and there's lots and lots of things that come into play when we talk about a breeding soundness exam but testicular size is very, very important. When we're looking at the size of those testicles, it helps us to understand if that animal has a high or a low sperm count. Now, the best way to do this is to take your mature buck or ram to the veterinarian and actually have them get a sample for you and tell you what's going on. But if you're out at a sale or if you're just out buying one and you need to know what you wanna look for, especially on your mature rams or bucks, we want to look at the circumference of the testicles. That is very, very important. And there's two numbers that I want you to remember. Those two numbers are 35 centimeters and 25 centimeters. The best number that we can get for our mature rams, that is rams over 14 months of age, is going to be 35 centimeters in circumference or higher. That is indicative to a very high sperm count. When we're looking at our goats, it's gonna be a little bit smaller. We're gonna be looking for 14 months of age or older, and we're gonna be looking for a circumference of 25 centimeters. So I just have my little Medline measuring tape that I carry with me uh, when I'm out and about, if I'm actually looking at this. For a general rule of thumb, 35 centimeters on a ram would be about the equivalent of two soda cans stacked next to each other that you would be measuring around. But on this guy here, and some people say, oh gee, that's, that's really big, you know, or that's too big. You know, this guy here is a Dorper ram lamb and he is only six months of age. And just to give you an idea of what we're looking at here, he is already at, so I'm gonna get the widest point of the testicles he is six months of age and he is already almost at 30 centimeters he is going to definitely be able to do the job for us now there's a lot more that goes into this we would do a sperm check which would tell us the sperm motility that is how they move and sperm structure but the studies have shown over and over and over again when you're looking at mature rams when you're looking at mature bucks we want to see over 35 or over 25 in order to make sure that they're going to do what they need to do. When you're looking at these youngsters, once they get to be about five to six months of age, depending on the breed, you are going to be able to tell if they've got what they need or if they don't. You want to avoid any that are small. Now this can hurt you when it comes to showing as well. If you're showing intact rams or intact bucks, the judge is going to hold this against you in the show. I was at North American International, I believe back in 2018, and I actually saw someone get disqualified. It was a beautiful looking buck and the judge looked at him and he put his hands on him and he said, there's no way this this uh, ram is very very small and he's not going to be able to seal the deal and it cost him uh, basically the championship so testicular circumference very very important and something that you want to keep in mind we're going to move on from this guy on to a buckling and kind of show you what we're looking at there if you want to check out our forum on facebook i would highly encourage you to do so it is lanessa farms tack box we have individuals from all over the world that are on there that are able to share information with you ask questions and give you some insight into raising sheep and goats no matter where you're located again that's on facebook at lanessa farms tack box so here we have a buckling, he's about four months old. And again, when you get into the bucks, a little bit smaller. So we've got 
35 centimeters for 14 months and older when we're looking at our adult rams. We've got 25 centimeters or over when we're looking at our adult bucks. But again, you can get a pretty good idea of what you're looking at when they are young. To give you an idea, this guy right here, again, I'm just gonna take my tape and we're gonna measure. And again, he's only a four month old, but when we do our measurement on him, we are at right about nine centimeters. So we're at nine centimeters already for him at four months of age. There are a lot more things that you're going to want to look at with these animals. Um, when it comes to breeding soundness, there's a check of the epididymis. There is a check of their penis itself. There's lots and lots of other things that you're gonna wanna look at, but when you're on the fly and you're just looking to see what's going on, you always wanna look for a larger testicular size it definitely correlates to higher sperm count. When you check out the description below, you're gonna see I've included a couple articles in there for you to see from universities talking about this as well. Please feel free to check them out. Thanks for joining us again today. Make sure you check us out at www.lenasafarms.com. That is where we have our online store and all kinds of other valuable information and links again www.lenasafarms.com. We appreciate your continued support, subscriptions, and thumbs up. I am Tim from Lenasa Farms, specialty in heirloom livestock. Thanks for joining us again today, and I look forward to seeing all of you again next time.